Hi and welcome to today's Facebook Live. Today I wanted just to address some questions that a lot of people are having. As my avid followers, uh, for those who have been following me the last three months, you will have noticed I've had a dramatic weight loss. So over the last three months I have lost uh, three stone plus. Um, and it, quite a funny situation happened today at David Lloyd after I was teaching. Um, I was chatting to my friend Janine who does the class like we do and there's this woman just like hanging around and in the end she said, um, oh sorry I just I need to have a quick word with you. And uh, anyway Janine went, because I, I, even I felt like, was it a complaint or something, the woman's like, I've just been chatting to uh, the people in the jacuzzi and we've all noticed how much weight you've lost and I just had to ask you why, how? <laughs> Um, and the mo the big thing, you know, people who don't know me, they all think I've had like a a, dr a gast gastric band or something dramatic has happened in the last three months, or I'm dying of some awful disease, and that's why I've had such a sudden weight loss. I'm alive, I'm not dying, and I haven't had surgery, guys. Um, I'm pleased to say, as my avid followers will see, that I've been seeing all the things I've been making and everything I've been eating, it is down to diet and fitness. Hi, everybody, for watching. Hi, Claire. Um, and it just really made me, you know, how many people out there are actually thinking, like, he must have had surgery? <laughs> so this is where I need your help guys if you do uh, know anybody that doesn't know me please let them know if you ever hear them talking that I have done it through diet and exercise because it's really important um, that we do get these motivational stories out there and to prove to people that it can be done you know so many people like do fad diets or some quick fix fat loss um, and it's all about obviously going for diet and exercise that's my secret guys it's not really much of a secret um, and for those of you that uh, uh, no I haven't used a filter this is me this is all me guys this is not a filter um, and for those of you that um, have been following me, obviously you know that I've done a bit of vegan, I've done gluten free, I've done dairy free. But basically it's all down to diet and exercise and I really think it's really important whether you're on Weight Watchers, whether you're on Slimming World, to change what you're doing. So if you've got Slimming World, um, obviously they, back, back in the days when it used to be red and green, there's two different things that you can follow. Um, on Weight Watchers you've got the no count and you've got flex. So it's really important, especially if you're a standstill guy, because I speak to a lot of people in my classes that have lost a lot of weight and then they're just maintaining. So it's really important to change what you're doing completely. So like I did, go vegan, go gluten free and just kind of shock your body and get the fat loss moving again. It's really, really important um, to keep on improving your health and obviously changing what you're eating. I know a lot of people out there, especially when you've lost a lot of weight like me, you just keep on eating the same thing and doing the same thing and unfortunately your body does get used to it. Um, and you know, it's uh, sadly we have to change what we do. Our recipe for success is not always the same. Now, I've been having a lot of this, which is sparkling water, which is basically water, and this is something um, that, um, you know, something that I really enjoy. Um, thank you very much, Adam. Uh, that's good to hear. Um, and Natasha's saying, yeah, about health book, absolutely. Natasha's health book is one that introduced me to protein powder, and you've seen the benefits of that. Um, somebody's just private messaged me, actually asked me about uh, about protein powder. The reason I love it so much is it's quick and easy. It makes you feel full. It's cheap. <laughs> um, and it's so versatile as well. I actually don't have it as in just a shake, as in water and protein powder. I've never actually tried that before. I always add it, make it into a smoothie with some fresh fruit or put it with some porridge. Or my other thing, did, you remember when I made some videos about the pancakes right at the beginning? That was another favourite thing that I used to do. If you're wondering now what I'm wearing, I'm wearing an XL. That's one XL hoodie from... Uh, Mark. Uh, let's go through the questions. Loads of people are asking questions here. Uh, it's actually saying about gluten-free and dairy-free. Yes, this is what changed my midsection. So I'll definitely recommend trying gluten-free and 
uh, dairy free. Um, a little point about the gluten. Um, I've got a lot of celiacs that are in my classes and stuff like that and they're still having a lot of gluten-free products. Now unfortunately these gluten-free products are not only high in calories um, but they're also very highly processed. So instead of gluten-free I'd actually say try and think about going grain-free and if you do have any unprocessed grains like porridge oats then do make sure they're gluten-free. So the, the grain-free um, is uh, important. Michelle's saying that what protein shake do you use? I use a vegan chocolate protein shake. So just uh, message me and I will send you the link. Oh my God, so many questions guys. I need to go back through them. Welcome everybody to the live video. Um, thank you, Michelle. Uh, let's have a look. Sally, I need to follow your meal plan. I've lost one stone in six weeks, but stuck. Okay, Sally. So as I said to you, everybody the other day, it's about going back to basics. So I've just posted uh, a few minutes ago my tea for this evening and I just had corn on the cob, three of them. Well, actually I had four, <laughs> won't fit in the picture. Uh, I had four of them, uh, loads of broccoli and salmon with nothing else, nothing, nothing. Maybe a bit of pink salt and pepper, but that was it. So it's all about giving your body, body pure products, uh, pure nutrition that it can obviously digest and get on with using your fat reserves. Thank you, Nicola. You did well in the class tonight. Thank you, Vix. Uh, Sharon, you're doing so well. Love seeing your passion for food and exercise. It's inspirational. Thank you for sharing. Yes, thank you, Sharon. Now, you will notice as well, now, I have been exercising for one year now. I've been doing all my freelance fitness classes. So what's changed? Why was I not losing weight before when I was exercising? Now suddenly I am. Because it's all about nutrition. Uh, for those of you who follow any bodybuilders and stuff, they're always banging on about it's not what you do in the gym. It's all about what you do in the kitchen. And, um, and for me, something just clicked and you know I just decided that I wanted to work on my nutrition purely because I couldn't exercise anymore I couldn't push my body to do any more exercise at that stage um, and so my nutrition had to change Adam oh thank you so much Maureen you've been yes Maureen you're one of my biggest supporters so thank you so much for your support uh, Maddie, you look good in your bikini. Yes, Maddie was doing a tour around DW and I was doing my bikini video. <laughs> I hope they join, Mads. Uh, Trisha, thank you very much. Um, any more questions? Let me have a look. Uh, Natasha, thank you very much. Barbara, post a link to your protein powder. Yes, I will private message you with the protein powder. As I said, guys, I was very reluctant to recommend synthetic protein. Um, but as I said, it's just so quick and easy to use and it's really uh, changed my life and changed my body. Uh, sticking to your diet, Anita says, I've done well, but I don't think I could stick to a diet strictly. Now, this is the good thing, Anita, about Weight Watchers because it's real. Uh, let me tell you, I don't post this, what I do on weekends, because you all know how to have a treat. I don't need to tell you how to have a treat. Um, but the last two weekends, I've had zero breakfast, zero lunch, and I've had fish and chips at the seaside. In Blackpool, two weeks ago, and in Skegness, just week got the week gone. So, Anita, to answer your question, I'm not strict. I'm not strict at all, yet I'm losing six pounds a week, four pounds a week. It's all about that bit you do in the middle. And the Weight Watchers point control is keeping me on track with the uh, quantity of food I'm having. Uh, thank you, Jen. Pip, uh, yes. Oh, thank you so much, Pip. You were dancing around today in aqua. I'm just loving it. But you're so brown. I wish I was as brown as you, darling. Um, thank you, Trish. I drink lots of sparkling water too. Do you find it makes you gassy? Um, I try not to have. I don't have more than one bottle, by the way. But yeah, can you get you a little bit gassy? But because it's the only thing I have, which I class as a treat, um, I don't find it uh, gives me too much side effects. Oh, Maddie, they didn't join. That's a shame. 
Uh, Pip, please say hi to Phil. Looks fab in his bikini. <laughs> Thanks to Barbara. Hi, Tracy. So that's it, guys. Thank you for joining me this evening. That's all I have to say. As always, if you've got any questions, as I said at the start of this video, please promote promote weight loss via diet and exercise as it works. Look forward to reaching my goal. Just two stone left to go. Bye for now. Good night.